believe it or not, northern men aren't as hard as their image would suggest. A new survey has revealed that men from Manchester spend more time on the phone to their mothers than blokes from any other city. A massive 58% of their mobile phone bill goes on calls to their mums. So, does that make us go, ah, or, yeah. <laughs> Well, Carol, you are dating a man from Manchester. I am, Is yes. he true to type? Um, well, he's, he's certainly not a mummy's boy, but yeah, he does, he does call his mum a lot. I don't know if it's actually every day, but it is a lot. And I like that. I think it's really, really Terrible. lovely. Yeah. 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 And I, I do, actually, because I, I, I kind of wish that I'd called my mum every single day when she was alive. And she's not there now, so I can't call her. And so I think, you know, when I look at him talking to his mum on the phone, it's a little bit kind of, oh, it's so lovely. You know, make the most of it. Because, yeah. you know, really, really miss your mum when she goes. Not so every day. I think it's lovely. Yes, every day. I've... Every day. Five times a day, if you like. I don't care. No, I mean, I think, I think girls, I mean, I, I used to ring my mum every single day. And we didn't really have anything to say to each other. And it got to the point where, actually, the pauses started becoming like little rows, little niggles. You know, because you just you end up sort of aggravating each other. Um, but I think a bloke calling his mum every day is a bit strange. It's I think once strange. a week, like Does if you've got his mum. Once a week, Paul phones his mum, and, and, and he does it religiously, and they have a really long, good conversation about Bo and, and how we all are and checking she's all right. I mean, unless, you know, unless you've got to worry about someone and they, you know, they need you to look after them and check they're OK, I, don't, I think you can do that once a I week. I think it's different for girls, isn't it? Like, yeah. girls ring their mums because you have things to talk about, don't you? You know, you know secret things. Know. Well, not and, always. <laughs> and, and physical things and, you know, what she should do and how she should do it and, you know, and all those kind of things. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, I know. My daughter and I text each other ten times a day, I have yeah. to say. But um, I think boys, as long as they're not... You know, there are boys that are mummy's boys, though, aren't there? You know, and, and you want to slap them, don't you? <laughs> yeah. But um, I think yeah, it's... Hard. Yeah, oh, but it's all right. Think, I think there's a respect... <laughs> <laughs> there's a respect at play as well here. Yeah, with, I agree. With, with, with calling home and, and making sure that your parents Everybody's are all right. Everybody's all right, yeah. Yeah, and, you know, Darren has a great relationship with his mum. They're really close. He doesn't call her every day. In fact, sometimes a week can, can, can slip by. But, to be honest, I'll have spoken to her. Or, you know, as a family... Everybody keeps in touch. Mm. And I speak to my mum and dad. Probably spoke to my mum yesterday. I left her house at lunchtime and I probably spoke to her about three times on the way home. Because I've forgotten things. Oh, I forgot to tell you this earlier. And then, and then they'll call every day to go. But that's it's nice. It's Ben yeah. lunch. That's How many nice poos is the ad? When your children leave home, right, and this is what I always say, I always say, oh, I'm really glad I haven't got kids, because what they do, they get to 18, they clear off and they don't even say thanks. And I actually <laughs> think, that's right. and a lot of the time, they do. A lot it of is the time, they do. I think you have to you know time. what? It's Every nice. night I go to bed and I, and I say a little silent breath, I say, thank you very much for my healthy baby. And, Please make sure he phones me when he's older. And it is a genuine fear <laughs> of mine. <laughs> no, seriously. Listen, that's, that's great, though, because then you're saying, I hope he rings me. I, you don't want to be ringing them all the time. No. Got, it's, it's really but that's hard. that's nice that Mark picks up the phone to his mum. Mo's got a phone, phone now, yeah. and I want to ring her and text her all the time because it's like a new relationship. We've never actually communicated independently on a phone together before. Yes, Sherilyn, you can speak. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I have to say, Ollie rings me. Oh. And he's three. Yeah. Oh. He does. He goes. I don't. I don't. I don't. Nana. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> Just do it. You know what? You have. I bet you, you make perfect sense of that. I do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> we have such few such special relationships in our lives. Grandmas, mothers, fathers, granddads. You've got to cherish them. You've yeah. got to put the work yeah. in to get, get the best out of it. Absolutely yeah. right. Absolutely.